As promised, I'm back to give you a quick update on my vocal fold swelling situation. Now, it's not because I believe that you think my life from my medical history are all that fascinating, but because I really think it's great for you to be able to compare, to be able to hear the difference between how I sounded a little while ago with mild vocal fold swelling and how I sound today without the swelling. So I had a question this week from one of my Facebook followers who asked if it was safe and healthy for us to sing while we're, we have vocal fold swelling. And I think that the answer to that really depends. It depends on how severe the swelling is, uh, why we're experiencing that vocal fold swelling, and what kind of singing we're doing while we have that swelling. And if you have any real concerns about this, that's where it's a good idea to go get the advice of an ENT. Go talk to your doctor and ask if it's appropriate or healthy, safe for you to be singing while you have this mild vocal fold swelling and what kind of singing you should be doing. I have had to take the past five weeks off of singing, not so much because of the vocal fold swelling, but because of the irritation. So I had a bacterial infection. The bacteria is long gone. It was gone weeks ago, um, but the bacteria left a bunch of damage in their wake. And so I am dealing with the aftermath of that. I'm dealing with the effects of that damage to my upper respiratory tract. And so I have a lot of, <clears throat> I can hear that. I have a lot of this thick copious mucus um, that's very, almost like acidic. It feels like it's just burning. Um, so it, it, there's a lot of irritation. And any kind of um, talking or singing or breathing um, can be really, really irritating on my upper respiratory tract and then it sends me into a coughing fit. Now those coughing spells are fewer in number and shorter in duration and much less aggressive and intense from where they were at the start of all of this. And so as a result, my vocal folds have finally had a chance to heal up. And so now that the coughing's not quite as bad, I've been kind of testing my voice periodically over the last week and a half, um, singing that tiny ooh sound to be able to just see how healthy my vocal folds are sounding. And as of a couple days ago, I didn't hear any signs of vocal fold swelling anymore. So now I'm able to sing I'm able to initiate that tone as soon as I want to initiate. There's no more of that delay in the onset. I can even sing a staccato. That's a really good sign that I'm able to kind of get the vocal folds just generating that sound really, really quickly right away. However, I did try singing a little bit last night, singing a song. My voice is definitely very weak. Um, and again, what tends to happen is I get a lot of that mucus that really irritates, which leads to coughing fits and what have you. So for the time being, even though it's really, really hard, I'm going to continue to sort of stay away from singing a lot, which means that I'm still not able to record any videos that teach you technique or give you exercises. Um, I'm not able to demonstrate that at this time because my voice is just too unpredictable and unstable. Um, I really do want to get to that, so I know that I've been filling up my channel lately with a lot of talking type videos, um, inspiration, encouragement, and information, but not a whole lot of technique. So um, I do appreciate your patience and understanding as I continue to let my body heal. Um, but I will get to that as soon as I'm able to. All right, take care.